and what I've been doing and uh, I haven't been streaming it because I've just been kind of like just just done it, I've been playing it off stream which I honestly didn't mean to but it's just <laughs> it's just how it is you know um, Um, but basically I'm going to show you guys what I've been doing uh, the last like two days of um, the last two days of um, me just grinding uh, Dauntless obviously as you guys know the servers have been struggling uh, I would highly suggest early early in the morning so just like just like now I would start playing it so you can get as much as you can and you can basically just get as much as you can in um and the next thing is I have unlocked like mid end game now where shit just got real which I will be explaining briefly on how you do some of the things um so this is the first thing is I have a lot of quests to do I unlocked Panga and this is this is a really good uh, thing to unlock so let's go through all the armor sets I have unlocked so far in the game so I have made the full set of scan and upgraded it to plus five then I have then I have uh, the full Boria set to plus five I've got the full uh, Volumia set which looks so sick which I will be streaming this set and showing you case this set I have made the full set of the Chowok, haven't upgraded it yet because I don't need another fire set maxed out. Uh, I have this Drask set and uh, nearly just need to get the gloves and upgrade it. And my main is plus five, you know, as you guys know that was my first ever set. Nasha is kind of a pointless set, I, I might not even bother until later later. Um, Helion, it's all plus five because it, it's pretty damn cool. Uh, I'm gonna make this full set later on. Uh, Panga, we can now make the last piece, so we now have the full set, which is pretty damn cool. <laughs> uh, next is Quill Shot. I've only killed Quill Shot uh, once, so we don't have any items, much items. Uh, next is Shrike. I've made the full set. Scrave. I've made the full set, oh nice. Stormclaw is a bit, you know, it's a bit tough but it's not too bad. I've made two pieces, just need to make these two pieces. Uh, I'm really struggling on getting glint tooth, I, I, I don't really know how you do it. So I'll that's all the, that's all the, um, like that's all the armor, armors I've unlocked. Weapons wise, I've unlocked, uh, obviously, quill shot. Um, I've unlocked the Valomia sword which I'm, I'm kind of grinding for currently right now. Um, the Drask sword I need to get the plus 5. The Helion sword, we've got the the B sword, we've got the Panga sword that's really good. The Skarn, the Scrave, the Stormclaw. Um, but yeah you got some pretty cool things. My quests, my current quests is break parts of Ember Main. I just need to kill Nezaga. Uh, I need to do one more shock patrol. Uh, dire warnings, you have to kill the special versions of the normal monsters. So, Skarn now has a Rockfall Skarn. Charog now has a Firebrand Charog. Nasha now has a Rage Tail Nasha. And Shrike now has a Moon Reaver Shrike. So, basically, they're just basically harder versions. And yes, they are very hard. Uh, Shrike and the the Shrike ones are easy, I didn't really struggle much on them, um, but the whole Skarn and Nashes are a lot hard. It feels like the easier monsters in, in the early stages are like really hard now, and then the like mid-tier bosses are now easy, so that's that. So now you got to kill basically Skarn a couple times, Moon Reaver, Shrike to get the certain items, just to get a bunch of like stuff. Uh, it also says I need to unlock uh, Dread Frost Boreas. I don't, I don't have that. So that's a bit weird. Uh, I got to kill a, a Drask with a neutral weapon, which is easy. 
and then I need to craft a Volumia sword which well I've made the full set of armor so let's go and talk about the patrols so as you guys know we have neutral blaze frost shock and terror wanting to get to my stage you'll know like a thing called dire patrols which basically means all of those special versions that I've just read out plus the Volumia you will be able to um, you'll be able to do now and but honestly it, it's pretty tough you need a, a somewhat of a decent squad or yourself to be decent um, there you go moon weaver shrike requires you to be 325 I am not that blaze behemoth fire band is 300 that's not too bad dread oh I have unlocked dread force boreas okay that's good uh, dread force boreas shouldn't be too bad I have a full set of ice anyways. Uh, we have Drask, Nezaga, I haven't even done Nezaga yet. Terra Behemoth's Rock Full Scarn. Um, but yeah. And then you got Volumia, which is. This boss is so cool. It's probably one of the coolest boss I've fought so far in the game. Obviously, I know there is a bunch of other bosses in the game, like three more bosses? Or four bosses? I still haven't. You know, even done, but so far I'm 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 enjoying the game. I thought I'd give you guys a quick update on what I am up to and what I've been doing. I will start to stream me playing the game from today. So in a couple of hours, once my mates online, I will be grinding. Um, I will be grinding at uh, the game. I might do a bunch of quests, I might do like one or two quests off stream just to um just to kinda you know get a couple things but um yeah I've pretty much made quite a lot um I don't know how many I made, I've just collected one, two, three, four I must be almost done with this because I start popping up like what I've done so nothing there nothing there but yeah if you want me to comment down below on any of my Dauntless videos if you want me to do any guides on how to def how to kill a monster how to get certain items um, like I said you know you'll, you'll, you will unlock guides and stuff within the game to kind of say hey do this and this is how you get this item so you, you know you, you will unlock you will unlock like somewhat a road path a road map kind of thing that will be like do this do that um, but yeah well that's it guys I just want to do a quick update on where I am I'm currently level 19 I haven't really been bothering with my mastery level yet, I've just been kind of focusing on making stuff, getting stuff, um, ah, uh, where was it, so yeah, we need to much stuff on luck, we have Boreas, Charog, Drask, Embermane, Nasher, Helion, Karabak, Nazarga, Pangar, Quillshot, Shrike, Skarn, Scrave, and Stormclaw. Uh, we're, we're still missing one, two, three, four. Or oh, and we unlocked a Volumia. So the four we're missing, I believe, is the Shroud and the other one, uh, Resikiri. We're missing Shroud and Resikiri, which is the two end end game. Uh, one of them is Rift Stalker, which is gonna be pretty tough. And then the fourth one, I I, I really can't tell you which one I'm missing. <laughs> But yeah, we're, we're doing progress. I will be showing you guys how to upgrade uh, your master. Where do I find arc stones? So arc stones, you need to progress this this woman's quest line. So as you see, my quest line is basically hunt all the special versions. Basically, you need to complete the stage before my wishes. Get to 300, complete. Uh, you need to kill Pangar, I think it is. Kill Helion and whatever it's called. And then you should unlock this I think next and you better do it but basically follow this woman's quest line um, and then you can basically just go to um, my stage which I'm on now and then you want you will unlock the die patrols I, I mean no like I, I this is no joke the die patrols 
are mad hard. Like you really gotta like be ready. So when I first went into the diaper trolls, I actually faced Falomia, which I'll quickly show you Falomia now. Falomia is a, a it's an unusual monster. This dude here, so he is really cool. I crafted the full set. I thought, oh shit, he's a new monster. He's tier nine. I might. I might get my ass whooped. He's actually really easy. Like when I say really easy, I mean he's really he's he's easy. He's easier than the other ones. So if you go to if you go to patrol, you can see the top left is Rockfall Scan. He is really hard, like really hard. The middle one is Charog, a firebrand Charog. Monasha said, yeah. So the second one is Firebrand Charok, I have yet to attempt him so I can't really tell you if he's good or bad. But yeah, next is Volumia, he is really cool and really easy. So I would highly suggest as soon as you unlock uh, Die Patrol's Author Pursuit, go to the Radiant Behemoths and I would highly suggest farming him for his weapons and gear because it's going to be really grateful. Um, and the next you've got the uh, Rage Tail Nashor, that's quite hard as well. And then you've got the Moon Reaver. Uh, Shrike, which is, eh, it's not too bad, it's a bit annoying, but it's basically the Shrike, but a bit more harder. Um, but yeah, basically, it seems like the earlier stage of monsters, like the really easy monsters in the early stages, are now really hard, and the, the really, really hard monsters are now really easy, which makes no sense, I know that, but that does what, that's what it seems to be. Um, uh, I, I would highly suggest that you do all your quests, so don't just focus on progressing story, you want to try and unlock, you know, do all her quests, do all the lantern quests, um, you're gonna want to do, uh, especially I would highly suggest you do the pistol man's quest, which I'll quickly run to now, because he gives some, he gives some really good rewards to really help you kill the monsters quick. Um, so if you do, if you, grenades, so you, you can unlock cold snap grenades, uh, you can unlock the firebrand grenades, but you have to do the 10,000 damage pistol challenge. And uh, then you've got to get a Helion tail and you have to get a Panga tail. Once you've done those two things, you'll complete this quest line and you can actually unlock the cold snap grenades and inferno grenades. Um, another thing, if you don't know what the cells do, I will be doing a guide, like a proper full on guide, which will be just like a quick, easy guide. But basically, if you go to, let me just go to like a really basic cell thing quickly, just to get, demonstrate what you what you do. So let's just say it is, increases attack speed when at low health, so if you do that, do that again, we infuse it, see it's green, so it's got plus one, so if I just speed it, just for the, just, just for the sake, I don't normally speed it, but if you, if you click on it, Remember, it's it increases attack speed when at low health. Basically, it's plus two. So if you have two of these blue ones, you get to plus three. So basically, it's definitely worth doing if you've got a lot of uh, of those um, stuff. Like I've got, like, how much platinum does it cost? Five hundred platinum just to do that. That's crazy expensive. Um, but yeah, do you, have, do you have any questions before I end this kind of overview video? Um, just let me know if you've got any questions, I will happily answer it before I end the stream. If not, uh, I will probably end it and then I'll be back in probably an hour and I will be streaming um, I will be streaming uh, this game and hopefully my mate will be online. If not, we'll still stream it and I'll bunch and I'll farm a bunch of diaper trolls and you guys can see how hard it is. Hopefully we get the Volumia because, well, it's just the easiest one out of all of them. So, but yeah, I'm currently, uh, I'm tier 28, but I bought the Deluxe Pass, which basically gives you 15 tiers, so if you take away those 15 tiers, I'm technically tier 13 and a half. Uh, well, well thank you, I sub and liked. Alright, well, thank you guys for watching, I will be back in about half an hour maybe, half an hour to an hour, I will be back. I'm just going to grab something, uh, so just going to grab a drink. I just chill for a bit, but I just thought I'd do a quick overview because I've been streaming this game in two days. But yeah, cheers for watching. I'll see you guys very, very soon. And if you're wanting to play with me, or if you want help, or if you want me to help you do any quests, missions, uh, feel free to ask and I will help you. But yeah, thanks again. Keep gaming, and I'll see you guys very, very soon for the next stream.